We bring in my friend Nate Wangler. A casual slide in as always, Nate. Good to see you. And obviously, this is the game we've been waiting for for a long time. Yeah, it's the ultimate. It's the end. It's the final game. We had a feeling it would all come down to the last game. Caledonia, Rockford. We knew the implications of last year's game and just how big that was at Rockford between these two teams. So we knew it would kind of come down to an end. At least we had a feeling. And here we are, ready to go. Now, we get a chance to see Caledonia. They're coming off of a 48 to nothing win. And even in that game, they didn't quite have everything clicking on the offensive side, but obviously their defense did the job. Yeah, it, it, well, and tonight they're going to be tested more than ever. We talked a little bit about this Rockford coaching staff. Jason Vanderlaan, the offensive coordinator for Rockford, spent a handful of seasons in the NFL. He also played under Tony Anise at Ferris State, and that's something Derek Peddington talked about. Two similar teams on offense that run similar style plays and offensive schemes to that of Ferris State. So as if the trajectory of these two programs wasn't exactly the same, that is much in the same. So it's going to be a real test here tonight for Caledonia, the most efficient efficient running and passing team they've played all year. Meanwhile, on the other side, you've got a Rockford team that's had some big wins this year, including a win over Mesquite and Mona Shores. They also handled Granville, a team that Caledonia had a little bit of a harder time putting away. Really, that was the only close game for Caledonia. Meanwhile, Rockford's had a couple of other tests so far this year. Yeah, Rockford has had a few tests so far this season, but I, I think the thing that really stands out about them is the fact that defensively, specifically this linebacking core, has really, really held down the fort and has kind of bailed out the offense in some of the games that they haven't been in. We talk about Tice Sigard, uh, Rick Beeson, two of the standout linebackers that they have on this team. They're going to be really, really important because we've talked about Caledonia has almost run the football without any sort of contest so far this season. They're going to have a their hands full tonight against those two veteran returning linebackers for Rockford. We cannot wait. We've been waiting for this one for a long, long time. It's Caledonia and it's Rockford. Coming up next, our conversation with the head coach of the Caledonia Fighting Scots, Derek Pennington, was able to join us to get us ready for this contest that they've been talking about all over the state of Michigan. This place is already packed. We are expecting the biggest crowd we have seen here for a football game in a very long time. Stick around. Much more to come as we get you ready for kickoff here on the Calzone Livestream Network.